Hey, what's up guys? Hey, I'm gonna show you how to make a sliding window in your deer blind. I'm in Lowe's right now. When it got me a, uh, what is that? Uh, 18 by 24 inch piece of plexiglass, which I have in my hand. Already bought one. And to make the slide, <clears throat> you wanna get the frame seven foot bronze five and six tenths it looks like this so you got a little track on the inside of it. got that track right so, show you what all we gonna do we go we go put it in that groove that's kind of hard to do when i'm holding this thing on the phone hold on see if i can do it <laughs> give y'all an idea what i mean boom uh-oh we're gonna put it in that groove, just like that. And I'm gonna I'm a mount the actual piece onto a two by two. So I'm gonna screw the two by two in on the side, like right here, put a screw in, screw it into the two by two. That way I can slide the window up and down. You'll see, you'll see, you'll see. All right, next you want to get you a piece of one inch by two inch by eight foot board. Just one. That's all you need is one. Hey, hey, what's going on, guys? So I'm back in the blind. I have my, from my support now, from my support all the way up. I got it. That's 37 inches. That's 37 inches from my support all the way up to the edge of this window. It's 37 inches. All right. From here to here is a nine inches. This for my crossbow, nine inches. All right, and I think in width, look at that width, I don't remember width. 22, the width is 22 on this window. I cut the whole thing out. All right, cut the whole thing out. And this, I'm gonna show you how to make the, the, the deer blind slide for a little or nothing really. Your blind slide. All right, so I'm gonna cut two pieces. Um, let's see, I'm gonna cut two pieces. Yeah. I'm gonna cut two pieces. Let's do 12 inches. So I'm gonna cut two pieces, 12 inches. One to go on this side, and one to go on this side. And my last piece, and I also cut a piece that would go a long way. But right now, let's go ahead and get these two pieces cut. Um, so we can get those installed. All right, when you get your board cut 30 inches, I mean 12 inches, you go cut your little your little uh, siding piece, uh, approximately about 12 inches again. I just use some snips to cut it. I'm pretty sure y'all will find an easier way to cut it. But it, that was simple for me. I just use some snips and I widen out the end that was kind of frayed in. And all I'm gonna do, boom, I'm gonna attach this to the wall like this here, boom. And I insert the window, slide the window up and down. So let's get the other one installed and I'll be back. All right, folks, this how it looks. This how it looks. So what I did <clears throat> on the bottom, I got it going from edge to edge. Of course, that's, that's creating even more support. All right, there's more support going across. So that'll stop your place of glass from, that'll, that'll stop the place of glass from slide. And as you see, I got, both 12 inch, uh, one by fours, one by twos, um, one to the left, one to the right, with the slide grooves that I showed y'all that I bought from Lowe's. And what I did, I just read a hole in the middle of the plexiglass. Uh, I'm probably, I may put a string on it. Um, I may put end up putting a string on it where I can pull it, but as of right now, I get in my blind, all I gotta do is lift up on it. And I got a screw up ahead. Hook it on that screw. Check that out, guys. Mm. Let's go, baby. Huh? Huh? Let's go. It's too easy. So y'all get out. Save some money. You know what I mean? And it slides up and down that easy. It slides up and down that easy. And it's, it's pretty tight. It's pretty tight. I'm, cool. I'm, I'm sure somebody can figure out something to make it even tighter, make it even better. Just give me a good idea on how to, you know, save some money and make your own slide. Slide up and down window. 
Uh, vice versa, you can do it going the opposite way. I could have did it with it sliding down. Um, could have did that too. So it can just slide straight down, but I like it like that. So maybe you folks can do it going down. Because if you do it going down, actually, now think about it, I might actually flip this around. We'll see though. Because if you, if you flip it upside down and say, for instance, we put our support bar at the top, boom, boom, and this at the bottom, I ain't got to worry about reaching up. So I might flip it. I might flip it and just put that screw, you know what I'm saying? That screw will be the stop, the stopper for it. For, uh, it all would be like a latch at the bottom. So I might flip it around. Hmm. 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 But anyway, as of right now, hey, we got to go, baby. Looks real good. Looks real good. Hey, if you folks haven't hit that like button, go ahead and hit that like button. If you're not subscribed right now, please subscribe to us. Living with the Donnersons. We got to change the page, folks. As you can see how the front is, I'm going to put some molding around it. But I'm happy. I'm very happy. May put some tin on it. Don't know yet. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Real quick. I also drilled out some holes here. I, I drilled out a hole. Show you what I got. Ooh. I think I got this from Harbor Freight. Man. Uh, this is six inch. <laughs> Same thing. Different boat. I'm going to put a piece of plexiglass. It'll pretty much look like this. I'm going to put a piece of plexiglass right here. And now that I did that, I may do the same thing over here. Where well, I can have a, you know what I'm saying? I can slide this window up and down. Now, because I, I got I got some pieces left, so I might slide do that to use that to slide the window up and down. This could be a, a gun hole, you know? Some will stick a gun out of it off to the side, knock some down. I might do that, let a little airflow in, you know? <clears throat> so I might do that. I might do that actually. Uh, but anyway, hey guys, I, I, I had one to come back and rewind. I went ahead and put a piece at the bottom as well, so it'll, it'll lock that window down. So when you take it off your screw, I'll show you. When you take it off your screw and just slide down, it'll fit directly in those grooves, and the window will stay super tight now. Boom. All right, no rain shouldn't get in or nothing. We should be good to go. And you can make it how you want to make it. You can seal it off even better. Do what you want to do. I'm just giving you an idea how to save money, make your own slide window. All right? Let's go. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Again, if you haven't hit that subscribe button, go ahead and get it for your boy. And y'all already know what time it is, baby. Peace.